example is because it focuses very clearly on those who've suffered abuse and acknowledges the long-term damage that that abuse does to individuals. And also, it, it makes clear that one of the added damages that's done is when people try and report abuse and they're not believed. And so it's very important that the church makes it clear that people who are victims of abuse can come forward with some confidence and tell their story that they will be listened to. It's also important because it's a restatement of the church's commitment to safeguarding. In this country, in England and Wales, we have strong safeguarding structures and procedures. We've had them for the last 10 years. But we can't be complacent about that. Because what we do know is that people who are intent on abuse will try and find their way around whatever procedures and structures you have. And so that strength and commitment to um, the, those of us who are working in safeguarding throughout the church is particularly welcome.